So for people who might want to ask questions later, uh, I would encourage you to move up closer to the front uh, for, le for later. But I'm going to start with questions by, can you single out a starting point for horse money? Was it a, like an image? Was it the revolution? Was it Ventura? Yes. Um, <clears throat> Yes, so, so I, I, I did another film with this man, Ventura, before this one. And I did other things and, um, with uh, the immigrant, the, the immigrant community, the Cape Verdean community. Um, it was always there, this, this um, idea that one day I could, uh, I should um, ask them and about that moment, which, as you said in the intro, was um, very important for our country and for everybody and, and for my, the people my age at that time. I was quite young, I was 12, but as any uh, important revolution, it lasted for, let's say, three years, three, four years, before it collapsed and failed, like every revolution. So, three, three four years, it's, it's, it's exactly the, the the number of years that you, with a revolution, that it takes you to grow up. Yeah. So I was 12 and when I was 16 or 17 or something, I had my education, <laughs> let's say. I always say I was very lucky because these are, this is the moment when you, when you begin to choose things, like, be obsessed. Um, for me it was music and then it was film. Um, and I was at the same time learning a lot of everything about, about my country, about the past, about that moment, politics of course, politics in action, so something that not, you know, the, the, the change in action. Actually, you majored in history, is that right? Yeah, in, so... You, in college. So when the revolution failed completely, I mean, when, when it all, was all over, when the, I wouldn't say right wing, but, you know, the conservative forces took over again, this time in, with a, a social democrat or democratic mask uh, took over. Uh, I, I went into, into history to, uh, to, to study history and um, before, before I, I went to film school. So uh, this was a very important moment um, and I always wondered being working and with his friends from Cap Verde that Ventura came to my country in 69. Uh, he was one of the first. They, the, all the, as you may probably know, we had a lot of colonies, African colonies, Angola, Mozambique, Brazil, Brazil in South America, etc. A lot <coughs> that we lost uh, exactly in 74. We lost. I mean, they became independent, they were fighting for their independence since the 60s. Except Cabo, Cabo Verde, Cape Verde, which is 10 islands in the middle of the ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, and they are a bit apart. They are, they were desert in the 15th century. It became the most important world uh, in the world, the market of slaves in the world at that time. Uh, the Portuguese, the Spanish, the Dutch, 
all traded went to get those <coughs> their merchandise in, 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 in continental Africa, Congo, Angola, etc. They brought them to Cabo Verde and there they dispersed them to Europe, here, etc. Uh, so Cabo Verde is a very, also a very strange story. It's a kind of lab, racial lab, actually, uh, at that time, and commercial lab. And <clears throat> and then it became a sort of. It was. Um, it's a very difficult uh, land, very volcanic, very very. Um, so all, all the Cap Verdeans have to go away because there's not much to do. There's building of roads, that's the only job, the work they have. They have no industry, agriculture is minimal. So the Cap Verdeans are 400,000 there and millions in, around the world. A lot in Boston, as you might know. It's an important Cap Verdean community. Um, Horace Silver the great jazz musician is Cap Verdean from Boston. Um, so again, I'm sorry. I, working with this, uh, being there around them, I always wondered was it, what it was for them to to live that moment, that that the same night, weeks, months, and then years of of this revolution that I told you. And I began with Ventura, this friend of mine who's a bit older than me. He, he arrived in 69, 74, 25th of April, the revolution happened. And um, a, f a few times in just having lunch with him or talking with him, I, I asked him, uh, where where were you that day? It's those kind of dates that you don't forget, that you know. And he began telling me his story of what he was doing that day, the day after, and, and the weeks, and, and what happened to him and to his friends. And, and immediately it seemed like um, there's a film here, there's something to be told, and something that was but that's that's not the main my main preoccupation. There is a story there, of course, a bit sordid, a bit not a bit, a lot, uh, a lot of racism involved actually. Um, that nobody had, had, had ever told, or because we we have wars in Africa. Uh, in Angola, in Mozambique, in Guinea, our, our young people were fighting wars in, in 74. It's, uh, with, with all the, the, the movements of liberation in, in, in those countries. And uh, uh, it's actually a fact. The day, the 24th of April, in the morning, there was a big, big boat ready to go to Angola, full of thousands or hundreds of soldiers to fight, to fight uh, those uh, those uh, resistance in in Africa. That morning, so 24 hours later, of course the boat the boat didn't sail. Everything was the war was over. All of those countries got independent very quickly, but the soldiers, the soldiers, the young boys, white boys that were going to Africa to fight them, they stayed, and suddenly, from day to night, they became left-wingers. <laughs> they were going to fight uh, this war and to to be at the service of a fascist government, and, and the next day they were, um, they, they had uh, berets and, and Che Guevara's uh, t-shirts, and they rode the tanks with 
with guns and uh, they, they grew long hairs and, and it was too quickly, it was too fast, of course. So what, one of the things that Ventura told me is that, that, that these soldiers, these boys, that you have, you see a little bit, that this kind of military jeep with guys, and, uh, they used to like to play games with, with uh, in the in the suburbs with with uh, the Cap Verdeans and uh, play games. So they took them to 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 the woods and they played their games. It's just a result from going from extreme right to extreme left in one night. <laughs> you know, it's it's complex. It's complicated and so they suffered a lot, those immigrants, those African black immigrants. They had a tough time and as you said, they didn't understand because from one day to another that they, they lost their jobs, like he says, everything was on strike or stopped, construction, everything. The very rich guys fled to Brazil or to here, maybe Argentina, I don't know, the usual. So the, the country was in chaos, of course, and, uh, and, uh, and Ventura and all his friends working in construction, or the, the women working in factories or cleaning offices, um, spent a lot of time wondering what would happen and if they were going to be sent away or, you know, like... So, so that's what he told me, in, in, that he was... The minute the boss in the, the construction, construction site where he was working said, when the boss said to the, the this thing will shut this thing for today because there's a, there's a riot going on like that. he he went home um, they had a meeting in the neighborhoods all these the Cap Verdeans and uh, and the, some of them decided to come downtown and to see the movement and uh, and then our let's say scenario our sc our script began so i started drawing a, a map of lisbon and i i was pointing uh, the places where i was that afternoon you know, the morning afternoon night of the first day the second day of revolution and where where he was and it's, it's sometimes very, very close, just, you know, some two streets away or something. While I, the thing is, while I was in, in the street with a red banner or a black, in my case, black banner, uh, he was hiding behind a bush or having a drink in a, somewhere to, and, and watching all this go by. <clears throat> So this, this is what, um, even if most of it is not in the film, it, it's the, the, the starting point. Well, one thing I 